My name is John McKeon, and I'm the moderator of the Teradata of Primo River community, Teradata of Primo's largest customer community. You can connect with us at teradatariver2.com. Today, we'd like to welcome Guyane Wang, Senior Manager of Data Risk Management at PayPal. Guyane will be speaking at this year's Partners Conference on PayPal Innovation and Offline Batch Processing for Rapid Analytics Insight. Guyane, welcome to the river. Thank you, John. Guyane has a very interesting job at PayPal. He works with the fraud risk and credit risk and does the analytics support around that. Guyane, that is a very important role. What do you see as your biggest challenges around supporting that? Uh, we encounter challenge in many areas, and one of the challenges that we always deal with is the increasing amount of data. And not only we need to make those data available for analysis, we also need to find out what information is really useful from a business operation perspective from those data and turn those analytical insights into business operations, so, so monetize those analytical insights. I would say that's one of our uh, key challenges. Guyane, PayPal operates in 190 markets, 232, I think, million accounts, 100 million of those are active. How do you have the processing power and the speed to do the analytics against such a large number? We have a different systems and different process of data acquisition and data processing from a risk perspective, from all loss perspective, so fraud risk and credit risk. We have different engines and either back-end data processing engine or front-end data processing engine. Focus on different type of risk and focus on different type of data or focus on different OTP process to absorb, understand, and analyze the data and then form action points. So we could uh, either taking a model approach, right, this OTP model, or we could take a batch operation approach. So we will have layered infrastructure and layered process for data processing. Guy, you probably you have hundreds, maybe thousands of possible patterns that might show risk every hour. How do you maximize the intellects for data inflow and outflow? That's a really good question. We're constantly challenged by the amount of data and the dynamic of those data sets. I think the point for us is how do we rationalize all the data coming to us, and how do we find the patterns of account behavior, and how do we identify the predictive data elements that could contribute to our revenue growth or to our loss mitigation. So one of the solutions, and actually what my session is going to talk about, is that offline batch processing. We all know the LOTP side, there is a time window we can, we can we have to respond at a transaction time to an online request. Uh, with offline processing, we could access a huge amount of historical data and a wider range of data elements to integrate that and from the process of the data analysis to the process of deploy that into a production process. Then take the next step to either our fraud agents actions or downstream OLTP process to uh, further investigate the transactions or the account behaviors. So it's a chain of activities, but most of that, when we talk about large amount of data processing, is offline. It's not the the OTP uh, process. Diane, so when you put this optimal batch processing framework in place, how did that change your data product development times? Getting to offline batch processing as a mainstream of a solution for fraud mitigation and loss mitigation is within the last two years. So previously, we... Most of our investment has been focusing on the front-end model. So how do we quickly develop a fraud models to stop fraud? And, or how do we quickly deploy a new system that can process more data on the online system? Then later on, we are challenged by the increase of the amount of data and also by the dynamic of different data patterns. It's no longer linear. It's no longer with tens or hundreds of data elements. It's beyond that. It's with thousands of data elements and with a much longer history and with structured and unstructured data. So now we get into 
the need of a large batch processing. At that point, we get into the practice of, okay, how do we quickly bring data from the LTP system to a place we can do analysis and quickly turn that into batch type of operation, the feedback to the LTP system. That's where we start practice. Now it's become a mainstream activity for us. Guyan Wang, Senior Manager of Risk Data Management at PayPal. He'll be speaking at the Partners Conference on PayPal Innovation in Offline Batch Processing for Rapid Analytic Insight. Should be a great presentation if you're interested in rapid analytic insight, fraud risk, and credit risk. You'll want to come see him. Guyan, we look forward to seeing you at Partners. Thank you, John.